Consistent with AMP's values, AMP Capital has had a long-term commitment to responsible investing. So we've been, after a long period of work, we've actually induced a new ethical framework, which will mean that we'll consider ethical grounds in exceptional circumstances as we're making decisions around investing for our clients. For you, this means that we will be divesting of companies that are involved in the manufacturing of tobacco, cluster munitions, landmines, chemical and biological weapons. We'll be divesting of those companies and we will not be reinvesting. We are completely convinced that we'll continue to be able to meet our obligations to deliver on our client goals while continuing to be a responsible investment manager and fulfilling our new ethical framework. This was a big decision, so we consulted with a range of stakeholders, including our clients and a panel of experts. AMP Capital uh, looked to be assisted with the ethical framework by getting some technical advice which helped them to draw out the core principles that they are going to rely upon. What makes this framework different is that the company has said to the world at large, yes it wants to earn an income, yes it wants to meet its obligation to others, but it won't do anything in order to be successful. The great strength of this framework is that it can be applied to any situation. It's not product specific and it gives a strong ethical foundation for all the choices the company might make in the future. This will be the largest investment of tobacco-based stocks by a fund manager in Australia. Tobacco-free portfolios were started really back in 2010 when I found out completely by accident that I in fact owned stock in many tobacco companies. And at the time I was a qualified oncologist and confronted almost every single day with the truly devastating impact of tobacco on my patients. So for me it was just a terrible fit and I realised that uh, I couldn't sleep at night unless I tried to do something about it. Tobacco Free Portfolios aims to work with finance leaders and the finance sector in general to encourage it to be part of the solution when it comes to this incredible global issue of tobacco. I'm absolutely thrilled to hear that AMP Capital is going tobacco free. It really sends a clear message to the finance community, not just in Australia but around the world, that tobacco free is the new baseline standard that financial institutions should be aiming for and now is the time to get on board and, and make the move. I'm proud of the decision that we've made to introduce this new ethical framework in playing our part in not only delivering in a continual basis on our client goals, but also playing our part in delivering on a better society.